That's right, I couldn't wait to get back on here with you guys. Today I'm going to talk about the fire signs. And I'm really excited to give you this. The fire signs are Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. We begin with the fire signs starting with Aries, and it starts in the spring. The fire sign lifestyle is all about life, energy, and desires. If water signs were speaking from the emotion and speaking from our heart, then fire signs deal with our soul. They deal with happiness, passion, sexual energy, our egoic self, self-love, self-confidence, self-respect. Fire signs like the feeling of power. If Scorpio and water signs were kind of truth seekers, then fire signs are definitely truth seekers. Speakers, okay? They are the bluntness of the zodiac. Most of the time, they don't care what you think. They can be adventure seeking, bright, impulsive, visionary, enthusiastic. They have great drive. They love moving forward. They're very competitive. They can have a little sense of intuition. Fire signs, just like water signs, deal with a lot of creativity and passion, so they spark the right side of the brain. Whereas air signs and earth signs kind of spark the left side of the brain, the logical side. Because if you're a fire sign, if you want to do something, they will do it. And sometimes it can lead to a lot of trouble. But they are strong-willed. They like those who have flair. They like those people who are strong-willed and have a good intellect and have witty responses that they can, you know, humor around with. Fire signs can fight for stuff that they're really passionate about. These are the signs that can go from 0 to 100 real quick because <laughs> they have a hot tempers like if you piss them off then they will definitely let you know and then they will let you know exactly what you did to piss them off <laughs> Aries is the start of the beginning of the zodiac they are also seen as the babies its sign is the ram and basically they want to be seen as the best there's only one energy like them. There's only, you know, one person like them. They have a very masculine energy. Aries people can be workaholic. It's the survival stage almost. It's about protecting oneself and your self-interest and having self-confidence, having self-respect. They can be loud and outspoken. Aries have a sense of innocence about them because they are the babies of the zodiac. They like trying new things all the time. They have a can-do attitude. They have a drive, energy, and a zest for life, which is crazy because they are a cardinal sign. And cardinal signs are all about moving forward and progressiveness and like heading out for what you want. When we break it down into Leo, Leos are the social stage of the fire signs. And if you think about a lion for a Leo, they kind of like to lay there and get fed if you know what I mean. <laughs> Leos are motivated by pride and respect. They like attention and recognition for things that they are great at. Usually a Leo will do something because it backs them with a lot of pride. Leo is a fixed sign, very determined. They love to pamper themselves and what they enjoy. They are patient and steady when it comes to reaching towards specific goals and moving along because they are a fixed sign and when they have their focus set on something it's like this is it this is what I'm gonna do this is what I'm gonna accomplish and then they get it done Leo's love to be heard they're all about interacting with the world having friends and communicating they want to only do things that they can really be proud of you know they're highly creative and highly indulgent and in what they love. The last one I'm going to talk about is Sagittarius. When it comes to Sagittarius, they like to be the best and have like all the best things. They like to travel. The sign of Sagittarius is a human centaur where it's got the top half of the human and then the bottom half of their body is a horse and basically this symbolizes how they can have good intellect and they like to learn things but also they have the ability to travel and expand across great lands 
Sagittarius is really hard to tie down a Sagittarius because they like adventure. They can go for weeks without talking to you and, you know, be okay with doing their own thing. Sagittarius is also the spiritual stage within the fire signs, which basically shows how they can be mutable, which means they can be open to change and free-flowing. Sometimes they care about what others think, but mostly they don't care because they are straightforward and genuine and honest and blunt and some people will be surprised by the things that come out of a Sagittarius mouth. <laughs> They can be shocking. <laughs> they are highly independent and they are almost like a yearning sign. They want what they want and they will get what they want. This is my quick little video for the fire signs. You guys have highly been requesting it. Make sure you guys check out my video, Love Me Quietly. My music video just came out this past Valentine's Day. I hope you guys check out my other videos. I will be making an air sign and an earth sign video for you guys. I know you guys have been waiting, so keep on the lookout. Love you.